Welcome to the pilot of Forts from a Cap. My name is Josh Average, and this series is all about audience participation. You will be telling me what I have to do with each of these forts. So for this first fort, our starting scenario is that we are only allowed to embark with at most one of each item. And then our goals throughout the fort is that we must craft rings and sell them uh, every time we can trade. And that is the only thing we can export is rings. And then on top of that, we have to tame a wild animal. Just one, but we gotta tame one. The season ends whenever we fail at our goals or we lose the fort. And that's it. Enjoy this first episode. Okay, so we got a couple of options here. Not a ton, though. Joyous Wilds over here. That's fun. Um, looks like there's some area over here, maybe. There's a little bit of area over here. Oh, there's some area with, with uh, water, and we're pretty close to the dwarves. Um... Humans and elves are pretty close as well. But we could also try over here. See what's going on. Uh, the only thing close to us over here is goblins, though. I don't, probably don't want to be over here. Uh, humans and goblins over here. Uh, scarce vegetation. Zone over here near goblins. Oh, yeah, there's a, just a dark goblin pit right up there. Um, well, darn, I guess we'll stay, I guess we'll stick close. Uh, we do have some, uh, woodland over here. So we'll have wood, we'll have trees, we'll have, uh, other vegetation here that we can kind of, uh, deal with. So I think this is probably our best bet. And we have the water. That's going to be super useful. So... Yeah, we'll start there, and then we got to prepare for the journey carefully. So, we're not going to have a lot of people who can do a lot of things. So, we're going to have one person who's a proficient miner. And... What else do we want to give them? Just give them a bunch of other, like, novice stuff. Oh, actually, you know what? I just... Uh, no, I think this is fine. We'll give them a bunch of other novice stuff to work on. And they'll get more skills as they... Uh, do stuff. I think we got up to... Armorsmith, so we need Armorsmith. Butcher... What else we're we gonna need? We get a woodcutter. Oh, actually, let's take woodcutter off here. And I think butcher was the last place we were, so planter there. So this will be our woodcutter. And we got to what? Brewer? No, we got to planter. Planter, we'll do Brewer, Gem Cutter, Setter, Stone Cutter, Stone Carver. Uh, we'll have one engraver. Have you kind of do the rest of this stuff adequately. And then from here, we need negotiator, record keeper, organizer, raiser. We'll just have one person who's like good at trading, I guess. Um, I'm gonna be a writer too. Why not? Um, let's see, labor. Oh yeah, we should have someone who can cook. So competent cook. Uh, 
uh, we'll have people learn that stuff. And we'll have our cook be our... I'll have to be an axe. An axe dwarf who can dodge. <laughs> Perfect. And then this peasant, what are they going to do? What's their thing that they're going to do? I mean, I guess they could just be our our planter brewer type. Just our, our general uh, farmer. Um, maybe have them also. What was the skills here? Yeah, there are also an axe dwarf, maybe. Yeah, I think that I think that's fine. All right, now we gotta clear all this. I know we could add. I know I shouldn't. I should just leave one of each, but I wanna. I wanna think about this a little bit more. Um, the big thing that's gonna be causing us a problem is that some of these things generate barrels, and that's gonna be a problem. I don't want to generate too many barrels because that'll feel unfair. Okay. Let's go ahead. We'll do cloth. We don't need wood because wood's going to come with the um, wagon. We don't need any of that stuff. We can do a seed. Like one of each seed, so that way we have seeds to go, uh, to go off of. We're gonna need one anvil for sure. Uh, all right, we're gonna need a a pick. We're gonna need a we're gonna need a pick. We're gonna need a. Battle axe. Need training weapons. Probably not. Um, I'm not gonna do any bodywear, footwear stuff. Cause we're just gonna make that stuff when we get in here. Uh, we'll get one dwarven wine. One cheese, one yak eye, one cave fish, one plump helmet, uh, Need some thread because we're not gonna be able to make something for a while until we get to the caves. Oh, we're gonna need a rope because we're probably gonna need stuff to make traction stuff. Or uh, barrels are gonna be generated with some of with I, at least the drinks. I know that much, so I'm not. That's why I'm not getting one of each drink because uh, that's just gonna generate a bunch of extra barrels, which I think goes against this whole thing. But that's what I know. I know that that. That that gets generated. We'll get one bucket, one splint, crutch. Um, I feel like that's. I feel like that's it. We got a ton of stuff here, and we got animals. So there isn't anything about animals. Animals aren't items. So I feel like maybe that's what we do here. Get a bunch of cats and dogs, maybe? Let's get two of each hunting dog. Two of each cat. And then... Uh, turkey hens and gobblers, maybe? Hands, gobblers, hunting elephant, war elephant. Um, what are some other? Let 
I guess we could just get like regular dogs. Right, I'm gonna add more. More of these. More cats. More dogs. What's another? Okay. I think that's good. I think it's I think it's enough animals. We're really overdoing it now that we have so many points left, huh? Um, what's our fortress name? Brass fed. Uh, let's do ring. Ring, ring should be something, right? Go. Ring seal. Ring rinse, ring sprinkle, ring spring. Ring string. <laughs> ring ring. Ring shrine. Ring shrine. There we go. Right, Ring Shrine is our name. Uh, let's go ahead and embark, shall we? All right, it's time for us to strike the earth. Um, thinking about how I want to do this already. So let's pause. We've got so many animals. I've really, I've really uh, done a silly thing here. Um, we're already really close to the water, which is good. We don't have too much to grab. So, got our one miner, our one, everything else. Our engraver, stone cutters, you're fine. Okay. So, I think we try and get closer to this little body of water over here. This little uh, or little river or creek. This, uh, yeah, it's a brook. Excuse me. Um, so I think we dig this way. Uh, we only have one person digging right now, but we'll get more stuff. Uh, we'll definitely get more more things happening as we go along um or more things happening we'll get more options uh for mining and stuff but we don't want to dig I, I say as i'm about to dig a whole lot we don't want to dig too too much uh because we don't have a ton of time or we don't have a ton of uh, resources for digging um And then once we get like blocks and stuff, we can put people uh, up top. Or we, yeah, we can like make a little pin up here. Uh, we'll start chopping down some trees. And at least digging here means that uh, it's very quick and hopefully gets that skill up. Or not, uh, the skill isn't even, doesn't even need to come up that high, honestly. Uh, alright, let's make our, our top, oh, not what I meant to do. Make our top side pile here for wood. Top side wood. And people will start bringing that over. Cat 
Cats are roaming around. That's good. And then we'll make a kind of a miscellaneous pile up here so we can get stuff away from the uh, from the wagon as soon as possible. And then we'll also start making foods and drinks and stuff because we're gonna we're about to run out pretty quickly. Uh, which I guess is something we can do here, right? Like we can just start gathering stuff. They'll start gathering whenever they want. I don't think we have anybody set. Yeah, we have everybody set to gather for now, which is good. So we'll get a ton of uh, seeds and plants and stuff. Okay, and then let's go ahead and start making workshops. So we're going to need a farming Make our kitchen. Actually, we'll wait for some of these corners to get completely done. Uh, all right, so we'll need a kitchen. We'll get done at some point. We need a Still, again, we'll get done at some point. We need a um, put a butcher right there and a tanner up here as well. Tanner, then. Kitchen. I guess we could put a farmer up here too. And what else? Did I put the fishery down already? I don't remember. I'll see in just a second. I did not put a fishery down. Definitely need a fishery because of our fish. Okay. Then. Let's do this. We'll make a little three by three room up here. And this is where our like miscellaneous stuff will go for now. Eastern swamps. Well, let's uh, make a fishing spot, shall we? So fish right here. Fish right here. Fish right here. Oh. Uh, some of those didn't work, I guess. Uh, fish there. It's the only place y'all can fish for now. Oh. Dogs are being slaughtered for some reason. That's not great, but okay. <laughs> not what I wanted to have happen. Um, but okay. I think something must be set to auto butcher, and I just didn't realize it. Um, okay. So now, we're going to do a little farm plots there. And then this is going to be our little everything zone. Uh, for now, no wood, no stone, everything else is fine. So they'll bring that over there at some point. And then... Do 
Hmm. I'm trying to think how I want to do this so far. So... Let's do two things. So we're going to need a place for our turkeys to live. And then we're also going to need... Oh, let's make a trade depot. We'll put that here. And then... I guess turkeys... And then... I'm just trying to think how I want it. I may have already messed up a little bit. So... Maybe we do... Little little hallway here. This will be have a turkey zone up here where all the turkeys can live. And then a carpentry zone up here, so we can like start making barrels and other stuff. Actually let's uh cut this off for now so that way they only dig over here. All right, things are getting grown over there, which is nice. Um, we are going to need... I just put that up here for right now. And then we'll have our... We need, we need this digging happening like right now. So dig, dig... Dig. Oh, we need a... We need a refuse zone. So, corpse... Oh, none. Sorry. So, corpses and... Refuse can go there, so that way we don't have things getting gross. Did you see that? <laughs> was it like the lungfish was like in the tree? <laughs> I think it like jumped up and then got in the branches. That's very strange. Why is our person not mining? Are they busy? Are they doing something? Miner? Oh, he's just drinking. Cool. All right, now he's now they're building. Let's get some barrels made. Someone come, please make barrels. That way we can uh, make stuff later. Make drink. Okay, still don't have anything, which is weird because I know we have stuff. Um, what's in the kitchen? Yeah, we got a bunch of stuff that we can make into drinks. Uh, 
Um, barrels coming. Oh, they're they're coming. Hey, it's still nothing. Oh, extract from plants. Duh. No wonder. Uh, drink from plants. That's what I'm looking for. Make that repeatable. We needed barrels. That was the thing. We've got the food. <laughs> Everything else was the issue. Uh-oh. Things are going bad over there. Oh, not the miasma. No. What was getting? Oh, it's all these rotten things. Ugh. Okay. Well, beans. <laughs> that sucks. All right, we're getting drink though. That's good. Uh, let's this then. So I'm going to go deal with that. Okay, and then what we'll do here is... Uh, we'll have the butcher here. So that way... If things go rotten, which it looks like they will. No one's picking stuff up. I need people to pick this stuff up, like, ASAP. Can I make a door? I can. Good. Someone make a door real quick so I can put things away. I can put all these uh, turkeys in here. That's uh, so much miasma. That's so much miasma. We're really, uh, we're really messing up here, huh? All right. Uh, did the door get made yet? So let's do four here. And then and here all of our turkeys will live here. We'll also get rid of those. Uh, these two. I don't know what's happening. I don't know why they're so avoidant on putting things away. When I know we have all these barrels, I know we have all this food stuff that needs to get put away, like now. There's got to be a, there's, there's definitely a, uh, so the launcher that I'm looking for, no, 
it's this? No. What am I looking for? I guess it's the launcher. Um I'm looking for the auto butcher. You oh hold on I don't all right let's do you disable auto butcher okay I think that was part of the problem first of all. And let's put our fishery out here, too. I should have done this at the start and put everything outside so that way we're not having these issues with miasma. But what are you going to do at this point? Outside of make everybody so upset. Everybody's so mad. I should have disabled the auto butcher like immediately. I don't know why that was even on. I probably had something set up to do that, and I've just never had enough animals where that was ever a problem. <laughs> I. Okay, I've got an idea here. Maybe if we. So this way we have like a little chimney happening, so all the miasma like goes up. <laughs> that might help for right now. Uh, just realized. No, let's make sure that that <laughs> something doesn't bad doesn't happen with that tree. I know something bad will happen with that tree. What's our miner up to? Making a wooden barrel. Okay, cool. I need you to stop making wooden barrels, I think. Okay. This should help quite a bit, the miasma situation, in the meantime. Um, still going to be a lot of miasma, and I will patch that up at some point, but... For now, this should be okay. Oh, everyone's so mad. Everyone's so upset. Everyone's so upset. We have so much food. We have so much food. What happened to all of our turkeys? They're all just wandering. Someone's fighting a uh, one of the hunting dogs is fighting a wolf. Oh, the wolf is not happy. Wolf's vomiting. It looks like. You be like that sometimes. Good lord, there's just so much stuff going going rotten over here. 
Uh, maybe I can make the things a little bigger. In the meantime, this isn't great. What's happening here isn't good, honestly. Uh, in a real rough situation with our items. At least we have a vent sort of thing going on, at least. So all the miasma can just flow up while everything is not getting taken care of. Um, I need to make this bigger. That little part. Oh, it's getting rough. Already off to a rough start. I if if the auto butcher wasn't on, I think this we would have been in a much uh, better place. But sadly, that is not the case. This, this is rough. This is a real rough start. I really don't know how we're going to get around this, to be honest. Um, how, how, how are we going to get around this? Guess what we can do is... All right, let's get rid of this, get rid of this. I think the other thing, too, is that... We need to get... We need to get more area for us to put our stuff in. So I think that's the other thing, the other issue that's being caused. Why are the things still being slaughtered? That shouldn't be happening. Uh, okay. This. Because I think the other thing is that there's not... People aren't putting things in barrels like they should be. Oh, brother. Make drinks. We need way more drinks than we have. Hmm. I should have you not be doing anything but mining, personally, but... Whatever. Fighting? I don't know. They're, everyone's upset, so... Everyone's probably fighting in general. This is not good. We, we've, we've really done a bad thing here. Oh, excuse me. We have no more plants to make into delicious ales and drinks and wines. That's not good. Uh, okay. So, make this much bigger. Then hopefully people will start organizing stuff in here. That's the plan, at least.
we can start making some stuff into uh meals so hopefully we get less issues with our miasma Then you door table chair. We've got enough wood that it doesn't matter. Why are we still slaughtering things? We should not be slaughtering anything. I don't know why that's happening. Ugh. At least it's outside, so things will go better there, I think. Uh, can I make a nest box? I can't make a wooden S box. I can make it with rocks, I'm pretty sure. our miner up to sleeping <laughs> of course Ugh. we really beefed it didn't we uh all right let's make put a door did i not make another wooden door oh i did okay okay and then we'll do uh table and a chair make another door just in case something happened with that first one that no nothing happened with that first one migrants have arrived hell yeah more hands on deck to help us with our awful situation um we put all the hens in here really we are, we are doing it, but, uh, let's do not meeting area. We need office here and we need to make someone a manager. I guess we'll just make them expedition leader, the manager. This way we can uh, start getting somewhere with our actual fort. Um, you make crafts here. Okay, you cannot. Um, we are gonna need some crafts because we. <laughs> that is something that we need to do. Is uh do that we need to make crafts so i guess we'll put this here for now uh oh no none none stone should go up there we'll put stone somewhere else but definitely not there Let's go ahead and bed, bin, bin, bone rings, uh, one, have ten, one, 
Uh, we have 10. Yeah, less than 10 is probably fine for that. That way we always have a handful of just bones lying around in case we need them for something. up this wood over there that's fine actually now that I think about it uh what's up with our pot okay we have one child Do we have any new we have a new miner that's good uh let's start building down here Something I like to do when I build forts is, like, make a little hallway so that there's, like, one big entrance and then you get to the actual uh, place here. That on elevation 5. wonder if they came with a pick or not. So, 20 for this hallway... Uh, do five by ten here, five by ten here, and these will be our our first dorms. Uh, in the meantime, we only have ten people, but it'll be nice to have two little areas for them, and then. Another 10. Or 5 by 10. And these will be our first uh, eating areas. And then we'll put a little hallway here. That should work. We'll see. I don't know why people aren't putting things in barrels. That's that's my biggest concern right now. Is that no barrels are getting thrown together. see and then we'll make a little like our first uh production zone over here uh, let's see here and then let's actually make this a lot oh jesus okay not what I meant to... Oh, this really blows. This really messes up my whole situation here. Okay. Um. Well, shoot. I didn't think we would hit the cavern so early. This sucks, actually. Um. What are we going to do? We've already hit cavern. That's not what I wanted. This really does beef it for us. We're already going to start getting, like, monsters and stuff, and we don't have, like, a proper like, military or anything. 
Oh, this sucks. Um. Yes. We like build down here. Just go. Oh no, I want this. Uh. Okay, start. Yeah, start digging down here. I guess. Oh yeah, no, no, no. We're we're beefed. We're boned. Can I? I guess I can make a really quick makeshift military. Oh no, I didn't. I don't want to do that. Uh. Wait, no, that's not. Did I do the wrong militia commander? Uh, I guess metal armor for now, and then just put everyone on it. Who cares? And then. <laughs> And beat the crap out of this thing. Kill this thing now. Alright, well, it died. God. What a nightmare. Okay. Um, it's back to normal now. Why are y'all fighting? Y'all just fighting down here? Like, what's going on? What's happening? Right, we got someone fighting a wolf upstairs. Okay, good. Love that for us. I've really, I've really messed it up. We're just having a really awful time here <laughs> in our, in our fortress. What the hell? Um, and we're still, why are we still slaughtering? Uh, roll panel? Yeah, the auto butcher is off, so I don't know why. I think that did it. I think that should stop stuff from being automatically butchered. But I thought we already did that earlier when we disabled the auto butcher. <laughs> so I'm not 100% certain why that kept happening. The only good news about us getting to the cavern so early is, means that these areas can now be pins and pastures. Don't know. Just don't know. I just want to build a place. I might have to, like, hatch this area then. I think that's what I'm going to have to do. Um, do I make wooden hatches? Or do we need to make... Yeah, we make wooden hatch covers. We need to make four of them. These need to be top priority for now. Hmm. Put some hatches here. And then... Guess... Build what I wanted to build over here. So... Do a 5x5 five five there. 
five by five there and then production over here. Hell on earth, man. And look, everyone's so mad. Everyone's so mad. Probably because we haven't had beds yet. Because I was too busy trying to stop everything else from happening. Four. some point a door will get put over there competent miner what's the other guy doing Oh, drinking. <laughs> That's why we're not doing this fast, because our other miner is drinking. Just fine. Do what you need to, I guess. Um, Bed, 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 bed. Storm. Except. Oh, nice. Lignite is over here. That's good. Um, oh, we have we do not have drinks. Uh, barrel. Plant one. Three. Storage changer is greater than three. That should be enough for us to start making automatic drinks, I hope. I'll also, I guess, have us. The. Okay, hatches are still getting made. That's taking a while, but whatever. Gather some more. Bunch of lungfish just up here. That's weird, right? That's very strange. The turkeys are still getting slaughtered. I don't understand. I don't know what happened there. There's no reason for that to be happening, I don't think. And I can't place why it's happening. Uh, make more wooden doors. We'll make like two of them. And then once we get this cleared out, we'll have a nice place for production to happen. Oh, nice. There's just a giant mole coming in through the... through our zone. Where'd it go? Just wandering. It's not even doing anything. Did it go back? It'd be very funny if it just went back. I don't know where it went. Oh, that's not good. Why would it be phone rings one? Why would it be phone rings ten? No. We got rings ready to go for uh our next stuff. Okay. 
Um, let's do this. Stone worker here, here, here. I'll get made eventually. This stuff hasn't even gotten done. I don't even know why exactly. Oh, we're about to have someone just go mad. I think once that happens, I think we call this fort done. Because, <laughs> oh, I've really beefed it, haven't I? Bone rings. Yeah, this is... This was a bad fort. I don't know... I must have done something weird with the auto butcher, and it's still going. Like, that's the other thing. Like, the auto butcher is still running somehow, and I'm not sure how to make it stop. I don't know what made it continue sir oh i see now everyone's doing this that's why that's why other stuff isn't getting done i love that we just opened a door to the caverns and then we're just letting creatures roam up. Okay, let's uh hatch, 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 hatch. Guess one of them's just getting moved and has isn't getting counted for some reason. What's our drink situation look like? Not great. EBH. of our dogs keep uh keep getting uh, attacked by wolves okay now we're getting somewhere with drinks maybe think we'll people will be a little less uh unhappy unlikely but it's a start i guess we'll need a bookkeeper at some point can i put a Funny to put like a little the bookkeeper's office is on the way to the uh the bookkeeper has a smaller office i think that's funny uh how are we doing down here not great Stable chair, and then we need a bookkeeper. Oh, well, we actually didn't need all that then, because I guess the, the expedition leader is the bookkeeper as well, or will be the bookkeeper as well. I'm trying to <laughs> I'm trying to write the ship but we're really in a bad way I'll just put 
this will just be a rock place. Put rocks here. Have fun. Put rocks here. Why not? You know what I always say. Wait, why did they suspend the wood hatch thing? Oh, now it's unsuspended. So someone will put hatches down, and hopefully we'll have less of an issue with creatures coming into our, our fort. Oh, two people are extremely mad. Is it even worth it to change my F1 to this? Probably not. What is with all the lungfish? What's going on out here? I don't know what's happening here. I think I need to, like, change something. Maybe if I delete this stockpile and make a new one. So, make this one a food stockpile. And I'll make this one an everything else but food stockpile. All except wood, stone, food. That's it. Maybe this will help us out a little bit in terms of like the organization stuff that's happening. I don't know, man. Something is happening and it's not good. Everyone's so mad. <laughs> Everyone's so pissed. Uh. Do I get rid of everything else? Someone wants more. Uh, someone needs trousers. Someone needs pants. Stat. Maybe that's what it was. Maybe having like an everything pile was really like causing issues, but that doesn't make a ton of sense, honestly. At least I don't think so, but what do I know? I love how there's just a bunch of tallow on the floor. Ugh, okay. So we do have people coming in to do a trade. What do we need? We need seeds. I think that's really the big thing. We just need a ton of seeds. That's if this place survives. I don't think it will. Uh, 
All right, let's start moving stuff over. Uh, our bone rings. Move the rings. It's going to be very funny if we get someone who, like, will not uh, allow us to export rings. That's just going to be funny. So how are we doing on... Okay. Oh, yeah, we need someone to do the trades, don't we? Broker the bookkeeper wait no different person we don't want the the expedition leader to be the manager the broker and the bookkeeper <laughs> i feel like we need to space out some of these things a little bit okay, there we go um raid that's not a lot of money for all of our rings but that's fine uh let's get seeds it's like our maybe our biggest thing we need right now. If I can find them. Do we have any? Do they bring any? Oh no, they did. Uh seeds. Seeds. All right, trade. It. We don't need it else. Look at how mad everyone is. Everyone's so mad. One, bro uh, who's happy and why are they so happy? Let's figure that out. Our miner is doing amazing. Poor empathy, poor focus, values knowledge, disdains friendship, and is tough. What are some thoughts you've had? Created, satisfied because of work. Remembering improving carpentry. This dude loves to work. Horrified reliving seeing a Gorlack die. Well, bud, sorry. Again, more things are getting slaughtered. I don't understand why. I love the cats just going wild in there. Cats got the zoomies somehow. Oh, we got more migrants. That'll at least help with the uh, with the uh, overall mood of the fort, hopefully, but we'll see. Probably not, though, knowing how lucky we've been. Um, let's make rock doors. Got three.
rock tables again three and rock throne again three those will get done eventually Like some wheelbarrows as well. Wheelbarrows as well. Like ten of those. And then we'll have those here. I don't think we made I don't think we came with any. That's not something I thought to come with. I want to see what's up with the people who are so angry. But yeah, they're like upset because they don't have like cups and to drink things with and, you know, the usual. Our miner's doing amazing. He loves working. He loves to work. He lives to work. It's great. He's having a fantastic time. Everyone else is uh very upset. We're going to get a bunch of blocks made, too. Um, okay. Let's dig out this area. We're going to make this a really big, like, food. Food hall. Actually, now that I think about it, let's like cut this in half ish. Uh, space, chair, table, 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 table. I like that the one other miner is like, I hate working. Working gives me no pleasure. Meanwhile, this guy up here, he's like, loving it. Wants nothing more than to mine through an entire mountain.
Okay, now we can make this into a dining hall. We'll uh, dig out some more area over here. Take another area for uh, production down there. Uh, and then this area I'm going to designate for... Uh... Actually, you know what? I don't need to designate that. I'll designate it here for a bunch of uh, bars and stuff and then take stop having bars go up top to this area And then I'm going to make a little storage room for uh, furniture here. So that also doesn't go upstairs. We're kind of turning it around. I think this is like pretty much a good place to stop for now. I feel like we had quite a bit of uh, excitement happen <laughs> for a little bit there. And we kind of righted the ship. Things are still going bad but not like as catastrophic as it was before. People are working, people are doing things. Hopefully things will get better. Um, we'll start moving the kitchen and the, the food stuffs down there as well. Um, that should hopefully get some things evened out and figured out, but everyone's still mad. Everyone's so upset. We got to get them figured out at some point. But uh, for now, I think we'll leave it. Uh, thank you for watching. Hopefully, uh, uh, Ring Shrine will uh, become an actual thriving fort. Uh, it doesn't look like it now, but maybe someday. See you all later.